And we are kicking off the fall season with some warm temperatures right now, but this warm up won't last long. We do have a cool down on the way. KCAL meteor meteorologist Marquita Brown is here with our next weather forecast. I guess that's better reason for them to get that equipment now, Marquita. Absolutely, absolutely, because change is definitely on the way. Let's start with the warmth. Really nice outside today, right? Beautiful fall day, lots of sunshine. We struggled a little bit to get into that afternoon clearing, but once it happened, we were definitely good. So temperatures will peak as we get into Wednesday. And then, as Pat just said, a pattern change comes our way. That'll happen as we get into the latter part of the week. And boy, what a change it will be. So let's start with what's happening next. We've got not one but two storms kind of moving our way. The first will mainly impact the Pacific Northwest, not expecting it to really do anything for us. In fact, as we head towards tomorrow, we're looking at what could be slightly warmer temperatures than what we saw today. So uh, it, looking ahead to your Tuesday, temperature-wise, we're looking good. 84 degrees for the folks in Pasadena. We've got 85 by tomorrow afternoon for Claremont. You can see some of those coastal temperatures will be in the 70s, but 90s for Lancaster and the Santa Clarita Valley. Again, the change comes as not storm one, but storm two comes our way. And that'll be as we get into the weekend. With that, we are looking at much cooler air coming our way. In fact, not only will it feel and look more fall like, we could actually see temperatures some 20 degrees difference depending on where you are compared to what we see tomorrow and say Saturday. But we could also see little precipitation in the forecast. So let's get to it. LA and Orange County looking pretty good as we head towards tomorrow. Again, maybe starting the day with the low clouds and fog, getting into some afternoon clearing. And when it's all said and done, we're looking at 79 degrees for you, not only as we get into Tuesday, but Wednesday as well. Here comes slowly but surely the effects of that area of low pressure as we get into Thursday and Friday, Saturday, we will really feel and again, see a difference. We're looking at temperatures that'll be in the upper 70s tomorrow for the valley. Big bump in temperatures as we get into Wednesday. Again, I expect Wednesday to be the hottest of the next seven days. And then we start to really see temperatures come down. In fact, by the end of the weekend and the beginning of next work week, we could actually see temperatures in the 70s. Looking at the beach forecast, again, starting your day with the morning clouds and fog ending up on Wednesday with nothing but beautiful sunshine. Low 70s will be the rule for you, really, over the next several days. Then as we get into Saturday, we're going to keep temperatures pretty steady in the low 70s, but it's not going to look good. We're looking at a chance of rain. The IE could see temperatures in the mid to upper 80s tomorrow, low 90s as we get into Wednesday. So there's your taste of summer. Then we really start to feel like fall as we head towards the end of the week with temperatures in the upper 70s. And then finally, the high desert showing lots of sunshine, but topsy turvy temperatures. We're in the Low 90s as we get into Wednesday, but upper 80s and even low 80s by the weekend. That is a look at what we're doing. I'll send it back to you. All right. Thanks so much, Marquina. Yeah. KCAL News, now weekday mornings from 4 to 11. CBS News Los Angeles, your local news, streaming wherever, whenever.